Okay, everybody, right, we're going to go through Thor, number one. This is the goddess of thunder. A really nice cover. I like that. Let's see what we got going on in this one. I haven't read this in a while. Oh, suit up this Halloween. Spider Man. Body suits for adults and kids. <laughs> Oh, I remember my son had a Spider-Man outfit. He loved to wear it. That was cool. It was years ago. Wow. Okay, now the Norwegian Sea, it says. Home base to submersible. We read you at 2,000 fathoms and descending. You should be coming up on the seabed any second now. You seeing anything down there, guys? Just a whole bunch of black. <laughs> I bet you... When you think about it, imagine going way down to the bottom of the sea. I watched some of those shows, and you're thinking the pressure of the water and this total blackness. And then you got some of the fish down there, like this one here, with the, with the light on it. That's very cool. Man, home home base, this is looking like a, a waste of time. We're at the coordinates for the anomaly, but our sensors are reading nothing. Must have been a malfunction on your part. Our techs say negative on that. Uh-oh. So they're looking for something. Look at that. It's like a whole mountain range. Full stop on all engines. See, um, Jerry, is it just me or do those mountains look like they're uh, moving? Uh-oh. Wow. Okay. Let's see what we got going on here. Reverse engines, reverse! Ah! So all these... Different wells or big um, giant fish mammals are coming at them. Submersible, this is rocks and sub sea base. Come in. We lost the signal. Did I hear somebody screaming? Uh oh. These things got sharks with lasers on their heads. <laughs> Activating attack sharks. All I need, all I've asked is just for sharks with lasers on their heads. Okay. Now, what is this going on? What the heck are you doing? That's our men out there. Okay. Sonar readings. Coming out of the trench. Uh-oh. It ain't our men. Not unless they just gained a few thousand pounds. Wow. Oh, look at that big giant hand. Boom. These readings can't be right. That's like the Himalayas rising out of the deep. Everybody calm down, okay? Whatever it is, it's getting closer. Uh-oh, external temperature is dropping rapidly. All the fish are swimming away. Boom. Look at that big foot. Oh, he needs a manicure. He's crushing fish, crushing sharks. One of the attack sharks just, just flatlined. And another. And another. You feel that? The whole base is shaking. Uh-oh. We're under attack. We're under, I repeat, we're, oh my gosh. Okay, what we got coming? Wow, look at that. Man, the ice giants, what are they doing under the water? Man. Oh, they're getting ready to smash the ship, or smash the base. Something happened. Man, oh man. Whoa. Very cool. Okay, we got changes come to Asgard. After a self-imposed exile, old Nial father has returned to his former kingdom, now called Asgardia. But his wife Freya, who had been ruling Asgardian Asgardi in his stead as the All Mother, has no intention of letting things go back to the way they were before Odin left. Okay. With the leadership of Asgardia uncertain. I said, what's it saying? So maybe I'll, read, I'll just read the whole thing. The biggest thing, though, is that their son Thor, the god of thunder, now finds himself no longer worthy of welding Mjolnir, his enchanted hammer. In a recent battle on the moon, super, super spy Nick Fury, empowered with secrets his, he stole from the Watcher, whispered something that caused Thor to drop Mjolnir to the moon's surface, where it has remained ever since. No matter how, how hard he tries, Thor cannot lift it. 
with the leadership of Asgardia un uncertain, and Thor now in a severely weakened state. It is only a matter of time before the enemies of Asgard strike, bringing doom to both the fabled realm and Earth itself, if he be worthy. Wow, man. Okay, this came out 2014, December 2014, so like October. Cool. Crime fighting, or grime fighting action at bath time. <laughs> Spider-Man soap. Amazing bath products. Okay. Wow, man. They're on the moon. The moon in the shadow of Asgardia. How long has it been? Has he been like this? So he's still trying to get that off of there. Days, weeks. What has he said? Nothing. Except the hammer. Perhaps he, perhaps he can ignore you, Freya. He can ignore you, Freya, but the boy will speak to his father. Thor! Thine Imperial All Father Odin has returned to Asgardia and demands of the answers. Man. He said, okay. Has become unworthy. Thor, Odin's son, has become unworthy. Thor! Please move in here. Please move. Wow. If you're, if you do, if you study Thor and you've been, been reading Thor over the years, decades, he's always becoming unworthy, and he gets the Thor, he gets the hammer taken away, and something else happens, and so this is nothing new. But it's like every time it happens, like when it happened in the movie, it's just like sad, kind of like wow. Arr, arr. He can't pick it up. That is all he does, day and night. Wow, just plain to see what happened here. The boy has been bewitched by his enemies. The Enchantress, perhaps. Or more likely, his own brother. Okay. I spoke with the mortal they called the Captain of America. He told of a great battle. His Avengers fought here. And the stars. Their enemy had been imbued with the powers and insights of the cosmic observer known as the Watcher. At some point this battle, during this battle, our son was left as you see. We know not what the enemy did to cause this. Whisper. All he did was whisper. Whisper? Did he say whisper? Speak, boy. Tell me what words were said. And he's like, I don't know what that is. Something wild. Something weird. Something made him drop that hammer. Yelling at him doesn't appear to be helping. I suppose you would have me coddle the boy, Freya? With all due respect, Your Holiness, perhaps it is not Thor who is bewitched. Well, just this morning, I myself tried to lift Mjolnir and Thor's, at Thor's insistence. Much to the shock of all assembled, even Vol Volstagg the Valiant could not budge the weapon. Mm. We all tried to lift it. None of us could. Wow. Stand aside, boy. This folly ends now. Uh-oh. God. Move, you blasted hunk of Uru. Odin commands thee. Why, he can't even lift it. Does this mean I've been coddling you as well? I will have the stubborn hammer melted into slag. How dare it defy me? I am the way and the wrath, and the wonder. I am him who speaks while galaxies obey. It would appear the enchantment has grown beyond even the enchanter. Perhaps that is for the best. Wow, man. Worthiness should not be defined by the whims of magic weapons. Rise, my son, and let the hammer be danged. <laughs> Rise and remember the, ham the hero that you are. You see, he still has his arm there, too. Hugin and Munnan, Lord Odin, your ravens. Be gone, birds. I have enough annoyances to deal with as, as it is. You're talking to him. Blood, ice. Blood, ice. Jotun, Midgard. Ugh. 
It would appear the Frost Giants have invaded Midgard. What will you have us do, my liege? Return to Asgardia. This is not our fight. Wow, man. Ready the Bifrost. We march to war. Hmm. What did thou... What doubts thou say? What didst thou say? I asked orders of their league, liege lord. I and she did answer. Uh-oh. Oh, they asked for the orders. Oh, she's not, like I said, she's still going to stay in charge. Odin has returned, woman. There's no more need for an all-mother. Uh-oh. Now that Odin has returned, perhaps there is more need than ever before. Thor, where are you going, my son? To the Hall of Weapons. Uh-oh. And then home. Wow, that's a cool picture there. Look at the earth there. Man. I don't understand how they breathe, how they make them breathe on it. I guess they're, they're gods and everything. I wonder if he can breathe on the water, too, like that. I don't remember if they showed that in any of the movies. You all heard, my son. Time to go home. Back to Asgardia. I did not think he meant Asgardia. We need to stop him. He has not rested for days. Uh -oh. And without his hammer, he cannot fly. Or And you? The fleeting age of the All-Mother has passed. Asgard will be again as it was for centuries, with Odin alone above all. It is time you remembered your place in the world, Freya. Uh-oh. Yes. Perhaps it is. Ooh. If she's in charge, maybe that's... I, see, I don't remember reading all of this. Maybe she's the one that makes it in battle and she gives it to... um. Ooh. Jean. Okay. Now they're going on to here. I've seen those dive teams out cut through Atlanteans like they were dolphins and those giants just swatted them away. Uh oh. Malakath the Cursed. The Accursed. They are frost giants. The most vicious kind of giant in all the realms. And you have something they want. Uh oh. Where is it? Where is what? <laughs> oh boy. Is he so? He burned him. Ah! He was being rather unreasonable. Don't you think? I imagine he regrets that now. Where is it? I, I don't. I don't know what you. Oh man, he's killing everybody. My, you rocks and tradesmen are a willful, unruly lot. But I am patient. I am a patient elf. Where is whatever it is? I can find it. I swear. Oh man. At last, a man of wisdom and courtesy. Please, good sir, work your magic for me. Oh. Whatever they're finding, my friends out there lost something of great value long ago. Something you and your guild have recently unearthed. Okay, okay, they found something in the deep, all right? They wouldn't tell us what. They took took it away, but I can find out where... Just please don't... Just please don't what? Turn your eyes into red-hot ingots? Change your, <laughs> change your tongue into a flesh-eating eel? Wow. Why? The thought hasn't crossed my mind. Mm-mm. Hadn't crossed my mind. Okay. Oh, gosh. What's happening now? Oh, it would appear that the delightful little rumor I heard is actually true. What, what, what is that? That little man is what a god looks like. Once he has been utterly humiliated. Wow. Well, perhaps the humiliation has just begun. Malekith, what dark pact have you made with these giants, you conniving elf? Thor, good to see you as well, old friend. <laughs> the beard, perhaps. No, it's not that. He says he's something different. Hole breach. Evacuate all sectors. Now you imagine that water coming in. You're at the bottom. He's still fighting. Yes, definitely something different about you. It's right in front of my face, isn't it? I know, but still, I can't quite put my finger on it. 
Man, he, Thor's mad. Okay. An ad? Okay. Ah, oh, yes, now I see it. Urgh. You've lost your little hammer. Oh, man, he ain't gonna be happy. How terribly disappointing that must be for you. I know how dearly you love that hammer. Well, look at the bright side, Thor. Without that big heavy Mjolnir to lug about all the time, you know, you've no more need for so many uh, cumbersome arms. Oh, okay, that's what happened. Man, I didn't know he did it. Wow. Look, oh, and this guy's dying over here. Wow, man. I see you found what I was searching for. Well done. Breathe easy now, friend. I mean you no further harm. Oh, that's messed up. And there's Thor's arm. Man. Frost Giants, never let it be said that Melikath is not an elf of his word. I have located your prize. Come, there is much more of Midgard for you to freeze and flatten. And what of the godling? Alas, he will not be joining us, I dare say. Wow. We have seen the last of Thor. Not really. Man. See, I keep wondering. There must always be a Thor. Okay. Whosoever holds this hammer, if he be worthy, shall possess the power of Thor. See, I see what's, I, I was wondering whether that was going to change. Look. If she be worthy. They put the S in there. Dun, dun, dun. Wow, that is cool. I hope the movie's good. But I still like Thor, the regular Thor. And But if they make her and she's with Thor, it'll be cool. I don't want her to take his place. But, they, I mean, they did it in the comic book. He was unworthy. But that's cool. Next issue, the Goddess of Thunder in action. Okay. And lo, there came the Hammergrams. So these are all the different send letters. That they're asking you to send letters and everything. This is pretty cool. Welcome to the beginning of a whole new era of hammer slinging action. Welcome to the all new Thor, number one. Okay, there's some variant covers. I got this cover, that's cool. Scotty Young. And there's some other covers there, cool. All right. Grim, Mortal Danger. Here's the back of the book. In the front again. All right, this book was won by Jimmy, Jimmy G. Make sure I get it right. Yeah. Yeah, Jimmy G comic guy. So I'm going to get this out in the mail to you soon. All right, thank you very much for watching. I hope you like that. Now, maybe I'll do a in more in-depth reading of it later, but... That's okay for now. Just wanted to show you the artwork and what the book was about. But you guys have a great day, and Collector Dude is out.